Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Brie back at it again with another vlog. Um, so right now I'm on my way home. I just finished doing Vanessa's makeup, which is the bride, which is my best friend since like seventh grade. Um, and honestly, I can't believe she's getting married. Like, you guys, she is 18 and she is getting married. And to think that I for real introduced them to each other, like, I for real did. I introduced them to each other and now they're getting married. So it's super crazy. Um, but yeah, and her makeup looks bomb AF because you already know who did it. Just kidding. Um, but yeah, like, it looks really good. I'm like super proud of the work that I did. Um, but yeah, so I'll probably catch y'all when I'm in my dress and stuff. And then when we're over there at the reception, I mean at the church, the mass. So yeah, I'm really excited about today. It's going to be super fun. So I'll see y'all later. Hey guys, what's up? So the res, not the reception, the reception is going to start. Let me like turn off my freaking thing. The reception is going to start in 20 minutes or so. And they did, they got married, whatever, they did the I do's. And I'm not even gonna lie, I started crying. Like, I started tearing up because I was like, damn, like, I really introduced them and they got freaking married. That's so crazy. Um, but yeah, so like, I've just been there since the beginning of this whole entire relationship. And now to see them get married, it's like, you know, I don't know, it just hits home. So I'm gonna go home, grab a purse real quick, a charger, because we're gonna be there all night. And then I will vlog at the reception and you will see Mr. and Mrs. Lopez. Might as well start it. <laughs> Say hi to the vlog. Oh, shoot. Hi vlog. And baby. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, most definitely. Face that way, and whenever you're ready, man. Right ahead. Hey, I'm Anthony. My name is Isabella. I'm a younger sister of the bride. John, you are a lucky man to have my sister. It must be a pleasure. <laughs> my sister has done so much for me. She's fed me and bought me stuff, like clothes and shoes. She's always calms me down when I need a breather. My sister has always been there for me whenever I need her, and I know she will still be there still. I remember right before I went to bed, my sister would make a face and do a dance. She would always make me laugh. She loves to help other people, and she is just such a good sister and a person. Congratulations, both of you. Love you, Adi. <laughs> All right, Renee's next. Hello, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Renee and I'm the bride's older sister. I first want to start off by thanking everyone who made it out here today to celebrate with our families this beautiful day. And I also want to congratulate Adi and John um, on the start on the rest of y'all's lives. To anyone who doesn't know my family, you know, I mean, 
sorry. To anyone who does know my family, you know just how close we are. And I promise what y'all see from the outside doesn't even compare to how it is behind our closed home doors. Since I was little, it has always been my dream to build a family just like my parents did. My parents' love is better than the fairy tales. And I've been blessed with the two best little sisters in the world. Adi is a very special young girl. Even though I'm the older sister, I still very much so look up to her. She has a heart of gold, so loving, so giving, and so thoughtful. I've always wished I had a little bit of more in her, of her in me. She is the first to get married and the first to leave the house. And if I'm being honest, it has not been easy for me to get past having to share her. That's probably why I'm writing this speech at midnight <laughs> the night before. But if there's one thing that comforts me, it's seeing my little sister so happy and ready to start her life with John. It reminds me of a quote by Dr. Seuss. You know when you're, re you know when you're in love, when you can't fall asleep because reality is finally better than your dreams. And Adi has found reality in John. I remember the day Adi told me she met John. My family and I were out at the lake. Everyone was kayaking and it was just my sister and I. She was telling me about this guy she had met on her lunch during school, and, I, and she wouldn't stop talking about him. She told me she had been talking, they had been talking for a couple weeks and were already dating, and I remember just looking at her like she was crazy. The, that guy from lunch turned into John, that turned into her homecoming date, her prom date, every Sunday morning church date, her fiance, and now her husband. John, you are the luckiest man to gain my sister tonight. I pray you never forget how blessed and happy you are in this moment, and never allow your love to stop growing for her. Adi, I pray you learn how to cook. <laughs> that you never lose sight of the love you've grown up in and make it your own and even better. Remember from this day on that y'all are a team with Christ being the center, a team that is destined to go undefeated. Never stop believing in that and I wish you guys a lifetime of joy and happiness. Nice, nice speech. There's always Lunchables. <laughs> right? Right. Hello. All right. Hello, my name is Steven. Um, well, good evening, everyone. Um, let's lift our glasses and toast our newlyweds if you have a glass or anything in front of you. Anything? Anybody? All right. So Jonathan, thank you for being such a stable force in my life, for being there through the good times and the bad times, and for, for being the best brother I could ask for. And uh, Adi, I think we can all agree that you look stunning this evening. And uh, you've come into Jonathan's life and made him such a better man. And for sure he won the lottery mirroring you. Uh, so Jonathan, so Jonathan and Adi, tonight we celebrate you. We all wish you a lifetime of happiness, love, good health, success, and laughter. May you continue to grow your love throughout the years to come. I can't wait to see what you all accomplish together. Cheers. Cheers. Tequila, even tequila, lo que sea, okay? I want everybody that has a glass, whatever it is, champagne, soda, tea, beer, tequila, you name it. Everybody. Here we go, all together. Pa arriba. Pa abajo. Pa centro. Y pa dentro. Yeah, let's give the bride and groom a nice round of applause once again, ladies and gentlemen.
It just ended and honestly my ear is like ringing because I was sitting right next to the speaker so I really can't hear out of one ear so we'll see when I wake up if I could hear um but yeah I just I'll insert some snapchat clips and stuff but the wedding was so much fun and Vanessa if you're watching this congrats Miss Lopez that is like I don't know those tear that was such a cute wedding and I loved being a part of it and thank you for choosing me to be one of your bridesmaids if you are watching this. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna go inside, shower, and go to sleep because I probably have to go to the gym tomorrow. But yeah, um, for their honeymoon they're going to California and then they're gonna go to Disneyland I think for a few days or something like that. And then she's gonna shop till she drops in Beverly Hills. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching my vlog and please don't forget to like and subscribe. See y'all in the next one. Bye.